well all right guys so i have a raspberry pi that is not actually working anymore so all it does is camera cover so all it does is it blinks the led a couple of times or doesn't blink at all so you can see the green led and nothing else it gets really hot around here so it's practically dead i've tried to do a couple of things so today we are going to do a drop test so first from around six feet it will be i am 511 yes and in three two one well that is kind of okay nothing seems to be loose one for one for and does uh, the green LED show yes it does now we'll go from uh, a we'll, lot more we'll high. go for it once more okay we'll go for it once more can I smash it huh okay and here we have the raspberry pi nothing's damaged although i might it's a devilish thing it doesn't break all right so you can see the <laughs> usb port is kind of skewed and uh, apart from that i think it should work led will still be working you know hmm. i can bet it's led well that kind of works now let's go to a bit more extreme of heights all right so i am out now and we are going to throw it from the second floor so there we go in three two one well it landed somewhere can i see yep there it is let me just grab it Whoa. and it is not that affected all right so we are back again and we're going for another try wait no Drain me nahi. All right, so this time we are going to flick it a little bit. And there. Oof. Okay, so the one of the other set of USB ports is a bit more skewed this time. And let's go up. All right, so it looks like one of the USB ports has been dented pretty badly. The LED will still work. It's LED. Apart from that, nothing else seems to be wrong. Alright, back in my room and let's see if it turns on. And what do you know it still does? Right. Off to greater heights. Alright, so now we are trying from double that height. It's actually the terrace which is uh, one plus uh, four floors of my building. And let's just wait for my friend just a second. Alright, so my friend is right there. And we are dropping in three, two, one, drop. Woof. That's gotta hurt. Okay. Well, not a lot of damage at first sight, but let's just go back and see. Alright, guys, so this is the aftermath of. Falling from six feet, then falling from the second floor, and then falling from uh, four plus one floor terrace. 
so if I can just focus yep there it is so first of all a little bit skewed and dented uh, USB port right there same is with the Ethernet port and only a couple of GPIO pins are actually uh, badly bent and we can because they are 5 volt pins we can actually test if the voltage is there and as far as I am concerned it should work I mean it's already dead but the LED should light up and we should be getting some voltage we so, failed it didn't block we yeah. failed it so but I guess if it's meant to go up in space it's actually meant to fall down pretty hard uh, and uh, it's it's pretty robust it's more robust than I thought it would be the LED lights up just fine and let's let's check the voltage godly LED the LEDs are godly so this is our 5 volt pin wow I might have actually <laughs> brought it back to life I mean if that happens I am I mean that would be sick so let's just it would not be sick it would be you know Indian theory of machines touch I guess this is the 5 volt uh, we pin. have to on it and you know, turn it on yeah this is the 5 volt pin and that is the ground okay I what forget. I'm going you know I'm taking the reading and it shows 0 volt oh a reading is coming and there is your 3 volts so that's your 3.3 volts right there and this is your 5 volts now the red LED has come on does it actually works I mean it's a dead Raspberry Pi I have posted about it on uh, the Raspberry Pi forum but can a little or a very much shock actually cure your Raspberry Pi let's 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 find out Indian theory of machines anything can happen that's a great song all right so I guess I have a bootable uh, was it what was it was 16 gig one or I'll have to check all right so we have our raspberry Pi and should be yep that is the working card let's put that card in and we have actually a jammed <laughs> SD card slot but I'll, I'll try to down back counter sir force it in and it actually fits although yeah and it will come out so that's not an issue and let's try to boot this Yeah. The hell it actually works. LED is turned on. Do we have a display? Do we have a display? Will the PC get turned on? No, it didn't. We don't have any display. So well, that's that. You cannot resurrect a dead pie. But you can make the LED come on if it's not already on. So well, that was it from for my video. I don't know if, why it's doing that blinky thing but well whatever and thanks for watching I'll see you next time bye